Charlotte, Daytona International Speedway continues to be Buddy Baker of Charlotte, North Carolina in this red and yellow car number six Dodge Charger. Buddy, one of the biggest drivers on the NASCAR Tour, six feet, five inches tall, 225 pounds, but he's an injured driver today. He broke his shoulder on this track, as we mentioned earlier, not very long ago during tire testing. He's suffering out there, you can be sure, not only from the heat, but from that shoulder injury. In second place at the moment is car number 98, Leroy Garborough, who had been leading, and in third position, number 27, is Donnie Alice. There's a crash on the track. Oh! This could really be bad. That was number 67. I spotted Buddy Arrington, who started, and now this is 61, who smashed into him. That's Boss Ellington. The yellow flag, of course, is out, and there's still problems with the other cars going by. Ellington is out of the car. He's all right. And it looks like Arrington is okay, too. You'll notice they leave those cars pretty fast because these other machines are still tra traveling at a high rate of speed, even on even the yellow. There's something else in trouble. This, this is Bobby Allison, number 22. And good that Ellington got out of that car because there you saw it being smashed again. Spinning into the infield as he tried to take evasive action, number 15 is Dr. Ed Hesser, medical doctor who also races stock cars. The ambulance is going out. At this point, it does not look like they will be very necessary. Where the driver's job ends, the mechanic's job begins all over again. Call it metal fatigue, tire failure, miscalculation, or just bad luck. Sometimes hopes for victory disintegrate into a tangle of twisted metal.